Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So as you can see by today's title, I'm going to be filming a show me a picture of dot dot dot. So if you haven't seen this trend, it is floating around on Instagram at the moment where people put questionnaire boxes on their Instagram story and ask people to send them in uh, ideas or pictures, I should say, um, of things they want to see from the camera roll. So for example, someone might comment dog and they'd have to show a picture of their dog on their Instagram story. Um, so a few people have been doing this on YouTube as well. Uh, the only one I actually have watched is Casey J's video. So I'll put her video down below so you guys can go and check that out as well. But yeah, it's pretty self-explanatory. You'll understand once I get into it. But yeah, let's just get on with the video. So I'm going to sit here so I can pop the picture here when I bring it up. But yeah, let's just get on with it. I think I have about 25 to 30 kind of comments. Um, so I will go through them. I've got my, my phone here. So I will go through them, show you guys the pictures on the screen and kind of do a quick explanation because I don't want this video to be too long. But yeah, so the first one we have was sent in and it was your favourite place in New Zealand. So my all-time favourite place is definitely Kaiteri. So I have three pictures, which I will pop up on the screen, that I've taken on my film camera. Um, so all of these photos are generally just pretty much sums up the place. Beautiful, sunny beaches. Yeah, I just love it. Makes, makes my heart happy. So, yeah. Uh, the next one I have is the first photo in your camera roll. So this photo here is a picture of my cat, Max. And this is the first photo that I have on my phone. Um, yeah, not really much else to say about it, but first photo of him and first photo on my phone as well. So the next one I have is show us a picture of your 45th picture on your phone. And this picture here was my 45th picture and it was also taken the day before I went down to uni. And this was like my goodbye breakfast that we had with Chelsea. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, the next one is show us your most colourful photo and this is a picture of Courtney and I. This was when we were down in uni and we were having a pride party and so we were all dressed up in lots of bright colours and yeah it's probably my most colourful photo. Uh, the next one that was sent in was show us a picture of your craziest cut or your craziest hairstyle. So on this phone I only really have pictures of me with short hair. I had long hair probably till like year 12 in high school. Um, but I don't have any of those photos on my phone. Um, but this is probably my craziest hairstyle, I would say. I don't really do a lot with my hair, but as you can see, it's a half up, half down, but the top half is in a bun that is looking rubbish. Um, this is the only time I've ever attempted this hairstyle. And as you can see, not the greatest, but that's okay. Uh, up on my screen. Um, the next picture is sent in by my friend Becca and she said show us a picture of you and me. Uh, so this is my favourite picture of Becca and I. This was my 19th birthday. Yeah, this is my 19th birthday. Uh, we went out for breakfast and yeah, we just did a picture together. It was really nice. Uh, the next one is show us a picture of when you felt comfortable in your own skin. I think this picture here kind of sums up when I started to become comfortable in my skin. It's just started raining outside, so I apologize if you can hear that in the background noise, but hopefully you can't hear it. <laughs> anyway, um, so yeah, this picture sums up pretty much when I started becoming comfortable in my skin. Obviously I'm still growing, I'm not fully comfortable in my skin at the moment, but we, we, we're slowly getting there. Um, but I remember going to the lake on this day and I was wearing, uh, I don't know if you can see it very well, but these are uh, this top, oh my goodness, there is stitch from Lilo and Stitch on my swimming togs and I did think I would be judged for this and I would, even though I really, really liked it, you know, people judge. Um, anyway, we're, I posted this picture and the comments that came back really made me change my mindset about how I felt because definitely in like high school and everything, I didn't feel comfortable with my own skin and I think at that time... I started to realise that it doesn't actually matter what other people think. I think that was the first kind of realisation about that. So yeah, but I also really love the photo as well. Um, the next photo I have is show us a picture when you are the most proud. 
Um, obviously I've had lots of proud moments, but one of them is definitely this one here. This was the last day of uni. We'd finished school. We were going out for, I think they call it like the graduation dinner, but we hadn't actually graduated yet. Um, it was the last dinner we had before we were finished forever. Uh, and this is a picture of Courtney and I, and you can just tell that our smiles just show how happy we are just to, it makes me happy because I know how much I struggled during that time, um, just with school and mentally and everything. Um, so that day really meant a lot, um, just to know that I was finished with that chapter in my life, which was sad, but also it was good. It was good for me. And yeah, that was, that's it. <laughs> uh, the next one we have is show a picture of your pet. So this one here is a picture of Max, obviously. Um, Max actually passed away in August last year, but he's still my pet and I still love him a lot. Um, Coops is in another photo coming up, so that's why I thought I would include this picture of Maxie as well, because he is still my pet and I still love him. Um, but this picture is so cute of him. I love him. Um, okay, next one is show me a picture when you faced your fear. I don't have a lot of pictures um, on my phone of me facing my fear because I feel like, I don't know, I don't, yeah, it's kind of hard to explain, but I think a lot of my fears are like heights and flying sometimes, depending, yeah, small spaces maybe, depending on the situation, I guess. But I think the day that we went skiing, I was so scared. Um, I didn't show it, but I was really terrified. Um, but this is a picture of me standing at the side of the mountain. We made it halfway up the hill and the van got stuck. Uh, where I actually went with my work friends. It was a really, really fun day, but the van got stuck halfway up the mountain because we put the chains on the wrong tires. It was a bit of a mess. Um, but this is a picture that my friend Tanika took of me because if we didn't make it up the mountain at least I could photoshop some skis on my feet and pretend that I went skiing. Yeah <laughs> that is pretty much it but I think I did face my fear that day. The only time I'd been skiing before that I actually only went on the like, magic carpet like the kitty slope and so I did actually go down the second like the small the lowest one that wasn't the kitty slope. I don't know what you'd call it. Like the beginner's one, I guess. Um, and I was petrified and I could not slow down. And yeah, I was crying the whole way down. <laughs> but I faced my fear. I'm not going to do it again, but I faced my fear and I did it. So yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, the next one is show us a picture of your favorite holiday. So my favorite holiday of all time would probably have to be when I went to Vietnam. Um, but I don't have any photos of Vietnam on this phone. Um, so my second favourite holiday that I've ever been on is probably to Australia. So I've got two photos here. We've got uh, this one of me, which is just me eating an ice cream because what else are you going to do when it's hot? Um, and then also we have this one here, which is the view that we had, um, which is just beautiful. So I really, really liked. Uh, the next photo is show us a picture when you were at your happiest. Uh, so there's lots of different times where I've obviously been happy, um, but this is one photo that, as you can see, really sums up uh, my happiness. This was taken at my 21st, and this was when I had my family and my friends all around me, and I just got to spend, like, probably five, no, it was like five or six hours, five or six hours with all of them with me and all of them here, and it makes me kind of emotional because it was such a good day. Like, I really really loved it and just to be able to spend time with the people I love makes me oh my god I'm gonna cry uh <laughs> makes me emotional we're just gonna move on because before I cry but yeah there's a lot of other things where I was at my happiest but that was definitely one of them <sighs> okay we didn't we didn't mean to get emotional in this video but we did um okay <laughs> so the next picture is show us a picture of baby you so I don't have a picture of me as a baby, but the youngest photo I have of myself is this one here. And this is me just sitting on the beach um, when I was little. I don't, uh, maybe I was building a sandcastle. Looks like I covered that rock behind me. 
Um, but yeah, that's the youngest photo I have on my phone. Okay, the next one I have is my favorite, uh, show us a picture of your favorite picture that you took in quarantine. Um, so I actually took pictures pretty much every day whilst I was in quarantine or lockdown. Um, and that was because I wanted to make a photo album of all the things we did in lockdown because my family and I did actually a lot of stuff together um, and I really, really enjoyed it. So I took a lot of photos and hopefully one day soon I will make that album. But my favorite pictures that I took, um, there's three of them because it kind of all is around the same thing. It is a time that Max and I went outside and we took the picnic blanket and as you can see, I took my book and my drink bottle and we just kind of sat out there and we sunbathed and we read my book and then um, it was also lunchtime. So I bought my lunch out and then as you can see in this picture, Max had his lunch and his water bowl outside as well. So it was really, really nice just to kind of chill out but hang out with Max as well. So it was really cute. Uh, the next one was show us a picture of a rare photo. Uh, so I don't think anyone's ever seen this. Um, this is a picture of me at my 21st um, trying to take a picture with my balloons uh, on the photo booth. But my brain that night couldn't quite comprehend that it would have to be the other way around to get the numbers to face the right way. Um, so as you can see in this photo, I had it backwards. And yeah, we tried our hardest, but that's that's a rare photo that not many people have seen. So yeah. Uh, the next one was sent in by Chelsea and it says favorite photo of us. Um, so I think this is one of my favorite photos of us. This is also from the photo booth of my 21st. This pretty much just sums up Chelsea and I's personality. Um, excuse me. This picture is, yeah, just taken on the photo booth with photo booth props and just got a glass of wine in her hand. That's pretty much us. Sums us up to a T. Okay, um, the next one is show us a picture of something that makes you laugh. A lot of things make me laugh, but the one thing that makes me laugh the most daily is Cooper. Um, <laughs> he is serious trouble, and when he gets crazy, he is absolutely nuts. He will just go for days. He'll be running, he'll be playing. Um, I shouldn't laugh at him. But I do because it's really, really funny. Um, but yeah, he makes me laugh a lot. Um, the next one I have is also from Chelsea and it says best memory. Um, I'm going to assume it's best memory of her and I because I definitely can't nail down a best memory that I've had throughout my whole life. So best memory of her and I is probably whenever we went on holiday together. So I don't know if you can tell. But in both of these photos that are here, um, we are both laughing. So the first one is we're trying to get a nice photo and whoever was behind the camera, I think it was Tanika, was doing something funny and we were laughing the whole time. And then the other one here, this is a picture of me falling on my ass and Chelsea and I were pissing ourselves about it because it was really funny. We were trying to do a uh, selfie timer and that didn't work. So yeah. <laughs> okay, uh, the next one is something that makes you happy. Um, definitely a lot of things make me happy, uh, friends and family, so I just thought I'd put a picture of me and my friends on here because, yeah, I can't put every photo up that I have, but, you know. Uh, the next one is show us a picture of Kaiteri, and again, I've, also, I've shown you pictures at the start, but I'll add in a few more here, just ones of the beach and the view of everything, and it is so, so beautiful. Um... The next one is show us a picture of something you're passionate about. And recently I've become really, really passionate, obviously, about YouTube, but I don't really have any pictures of me doing YouTube. The other thing that I've become super passionate about in the probably the past six months, maybe, is photography. Um, and this picture here is the only picture I have of me actually doing photography. It is a selfie on my disposable camera, but I do have another smaller camera which I use from time to time, but yeah, this is the only picture I have of me doing photography and I love it, it's cute. Uh, the next photo I have is the last photo that was taken with food. And so technically this photo isn't just food, but it's the last photo I have with food in it. 
so this is a picture of Tanika and I when we went out for a picnic and as you can see there's some McDonald's in the picture so technically it's food. Uh, the next one I have is show us a picture of the last picture you took of someone else. If that makes sense. The last picture I took of someone else. And this was on my film camera. And this is a picture of when we were in Kaiteri again. And it's just me and my friends climbing on the rocks. So yeah. Uh, this next picture is show us your last selfie. So this picture was taken the other day. And this is a picture, as you can see, of me with salad and the disgust on my face, as you can tell, um, didn't really enjoy that salad. It was like a lettuce and red onion salad with like carrot and then some like deep fried cheese balls or something. I don't know. It was kind of weird. Um, it was at work, but yeah, I didn't really enjoy it that much. So that's why it's disgust on my face because I sent it to my friends and said, mm, look at my salad. Yeah. Okay. Uh, we've got a f two more photos left, but the next one is show us a picture of your dog. Um, so we have Coops here now, but this is a picture, the latest picture of Coops that I've taken. He had a haircut the other day, and so this is what his new haircut looks like. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. And the last picture I have here is show us the last picture you took on your phone. So this is technically my last picture. This is a selfie I took uh, last night. Yeah, selfie I took last night. Um, so this is technically my last selfie as well, but I wanted to include my last selfie, so I just did the one before that. But yeah, this photo was taken yesterday, and that's about it. That's all I can say about that one. Um, yeah, just a picture of me taking a selfie. So yeah. So that is it. That is all the photos that I have that you guys have asked me to share. Um, please let me know if you want me to do a part two of this video. I really enjoyed doing this video. Um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video as well. Please give it a big thumbs up if you did. Subscribe down below. My goal is to reach 100 subscribers by the end of this year and we're at 75. So there's only like 25 more to go, which I'm super, super excited for. So please subscribe if you're watching this and you're not subscribed because I think 60% of you are not subscribed when you watch my videos. So I would really, really appreciate it if you did subscribe. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. I don't know if you guys could tell, but I am now uploading two days a week. I am uploading Mondays and Thursdays. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you next time with another video. Bye guys.